so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Oh, hey! It's me, Blippi. And look at what I have here. Whoa, this is a scale. Yeah, you put one thing on this side and one thing on this side, or many things, and whatever way it tips will tell you what's heavier and what is lighter. Okay, let's try a really easy example. I'm gonna take these off. What do you think is heavier and what do you think is lighter? A feather? <laughs> Tickle. Or a rock? Yeah, I bet. Yeah, the rock is gonna be heavier than the feather. Ready? Yeah, do you see how the rock is lower? Yeah, because this side is heavier. Okay, I have another idea. How about a bunch of these feathers? Whoa, yeah, <laughs> that's a lot of feathers. <laughs> Whoa, and the feathers are so colorful. And to make it even, we need to add the carrying case on this side too. Okay, now let's see if all these feathers weigh more or less than this rock. Ready? Oh, that one rock is heavier than all of these feathers. Whoa! Whoa! That is so cool. Okay, let me put that rock over there. Put this back up here. Wow. We have to stay nice and clean and organized because we have a lot of things to weigh here. Hey, okay. all right. Hey, check these out. What kind of fruit are these? Do you know? Yeah, this one is an apple. And this one is an orange. Yum! <laughs> I love fruit. And I love vegetables. Okay, let's see. Huh, they weigh roughly the same. I wonder what one's gonna be heavier, what one's gonna be lighter. Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa, do you see that? Yeah. The apple is heavier. Wow. <laughs> and it's bigger. But that isn't always the case. Remember? Yeah. The feathers were so big. And then the rock was so small. But the feathers, yeah, were lighter than the rock. So it's all about density. Yeah, let's see here. Ooh, look at these. <laughs> wow, these are cubes. And they actually are pretty, whoa, <laughs> light. <laughs> wow. See, even one barely even tipped the scale. Okay, so let's go like this. Okay. There are four on that side. Actually, let's do three. <laughs> okay, now the same cubes on this side. Let's do five. What one do you think will be heavier? Yeah, you're right. Five cubes of the same size and same weight is heavier than three cubes of the same size and weight. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, all right, let's get back to weighing things. Okay, let's put these rocks over here. Let's gather up all the feathers. We need to pick up after ourselves. Perfect, put those right over there. <laughs> Although they're so cute and pretty. <laughs> okay, all right, now we have some dinosaurs. <laughs> we have a T-Rex. <laughs> Okay, you can stand right there. Oh, well, how about you just take a nap? Just like that. <laughs> and then we have a triceratops. <laughs> okay, let's see what toy weighs more. I don't know the actual dinosaur weight, but just for these toys. Yeah, this T-Rex is heavier than the triceratops. But what if we added a brontosaurus to it? All right, are you ready? These are definitely heavier. <laughs> okay, we'll put those aside. All right, now we have an experiment. 
Okay, we have rice and we have water. So let's put the same amount of rice in a balloon compared to the water, the same amount. So let's do a quarter of a cup. And then we can see what one is heavier, which means which one is more dense? Because they're actually going to be roughly the, the, no, they will be the, the same size. Yeah, because one quarter of a cup is volume. Perfect. All right. <laughs> Sometimes it can be so confusing. <laughs> okay. All right. One quarter of a cup. Make sure it's nice and what? Perfect. Okay. Oh, got to set that down right here. Need to prep my balloon first. Perfect. There we go. Okay. Got to use the funnel or else it would be really dirty. <laughs> okay. Here we go. One quarter cup. Let me tie it. Okay, now I'll do the water. All right. Okay, now we need one quarter of a cup of water. Whoa. I don't want to spill. Ready? nice and organized be sure to clean up all right now let me tie this okay so we use the same amount of volume one quarter cup of rice one quarter cup of water okay, now we get to do the fun part we get to put it on the scale and we get to see which one is more dense which one is heavier ready The blue was rice. Whoa, rice is more dense than water. Whoa, woo, woo, woo. Hey, do you know what else is really heavy? Yeah, construction vehicles are really heavy. Yeah, like this excavator or this front loader. Whoa, huh. this excavator is actually heavier than this front loader toy. Whoa, <laughs> hey, I have an idea. Since we're talking about weight and machines are really, really, really heavy. Let me think about a machine that is very heavy, low to the ground and can push everything out of its way. Do you know what machine that is? Yeah, look at the big front blade on it. Yeah, that is a bulldozer. Hey, I think we should learn and watch the bulldozer video. <laughs> bulldozer, clearing the land. Bulldozer, pushing rubble and sand. Bulldozer, constructing the roads. Move over, it's about to roll. It's a yellow tracked machine. Found on mines, farms, and factories. Most anything Bulldozers turn up debris Bulldozers help the farmers work By breaking up rocks and digging in the dirt With the blade on the front and the claw on the back It can help you build a home just like that Whoa, it's on a roll Bulldozer Some rough terrain. They can move all kinds of things. Bulldozer, clearing the land. Bulldozer, pushing rubble and sand. Bulldozer, constructing the roads. Move over, it's about to roll. Bulldozer, clearing the land. Bulldozer, pushing rubble and sand. Bulldozer. Better move over, here comes the bulldozer. It's a yellow machine. 
and bulldozer Better move over, here comes the it's bulldozer It's a yellow machine Ring, ring Alright, <laughs> put in the blocks, here we go Go to the other side, dump them out There we go, two more blocks on this side Hmm, let's see Maybe the rock will make it heavy enough. Whoa! It for sure was heavy enough. Wow, that was so much fun learning about weight with you. And also, bulldozers. Wow, those machines are so heavy. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, I'm going to clean up now. Flippy. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Flippy. Hey, it's me, Blippy. Ooh, what is this? This is a tank, and today we're going to fill it up with water, go around the park, find items to see if they'll either sink or float. But first, we need water. <laughs> Good thing I have a bunch of water. Let's fill it up. One. This looks like the perfect amount of water. Now, let's go to the park, find items, so then we can see if they'll either sink or float. Let's go. Okay, now let's find some items at the playground, and so then we can see if they'll sink or float. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, look at this. How convenient. It's a tote. Whoa! So then we can put all the items in here. Let's go! Whoa! A rock wall! See? You climb up it. Whoa, whoa! Oh! And look at what it is! Whoa! Look! Some toys! Blue and orange! Okay, watch me climb up the rock wall. Red slide! Whoa! Look at the bottom! Whoa! Look! Whoa! Yeah! Look at what we found! Two more items! These are oranges! Yum! I love oranges! And they're the color orange! <laughs> okay, let's go! found another item. Do you see it? Yeah, see? Right here. This is a dumbbell. Urgh. Makes really big muscles. Yeah. Urgh. Yeah. 
Yeah, okay. I wonder if it'll sink or float. It's pretty heavy. Put it in there. Let's go, come on. Whoa, <laughs> another slide. Look, this is the same color as the last side. It's big and red. <gasps> Whoa, look. Yum, some chips. <laughs> I wonder if these will sink or float. Let's put it in the tote so we can go see. Wow, look at this area. Whoa, go the other way. Whoa, hello. <laughs> oh, look, another item. Whoa, it's a dog bone. What's this doing on the playset? Hmm, it's the color green. I wonder if this will sink or float. Put it in there so we can go find out. Whoa. Wow. The color green and then also blue. Whoa. Oh, hey, some stairs. So high up here, whoa, whoa, oh look over there. A big red slide. Okay, I'll go down. Okay, here I come. <laughs> whoa, <laughs> that was awesome. Oh hey, look at what we found. Four yo-yos. One is the color green, this one, is the color orange, this one is the color blue, and this one is the color red. Let's go see what else we can find. Come over here. What is this? Looks like a steering wheel. Whoa! Whoa! I am so dizzy! Okay, let's go see what else we can find. Woo, look at this. Looks like a staircase. Hello. <laughs> Ooh, another slide. Yeah, and it's the color red. All right, here I come. Whoa. <laughs> Do you see what I see? Yeah, another item. And these are colored pencils. Whoa, there's so many colors in there. Wow. Okay, let's put it in the tote so we can see if they'll sink or float. Come on. Couple more items, then the tote will be nice and full. Come on. Do you see what I see? <laughs> Look! Wow, this is a magnifying glass. Watch this. Whoa! Wow! Hello! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> you can see things nice and close. Whoa, is that an ant? Whoa, a little flea. <laughs> so many cool insects. Okay, let's put this in the tote so we can see if it'll sink or float. Ooh, what's over here? Whoa, whoa, a bridge. Be careful on this, come on. Toys. Hey, hello. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> wow, so many cool things. Oh, even more. Ooh, bright yellow golf balls. One, two, 
three! Yeah, three golf balls. Okay, here I go. Another slide. Oh, whoa. There's another item down here. Ooh, glow sticks. I'm excited to see if those will sink or float. All right, this looks like a full tote of items. Let's go see if they'll sink or float. <laughs> Ooh, awesome. All right, now that we have all of these items, now we can put them in the tank and see if they'll sink or float. All right, let's see, what do we have here? Ooh, a magnifying glass. Ooh. <laughs> All right. I wonder if this will sink or float. I think I know. Ready? Yeah. It went to the bottom. So that means it sinks. All right. What else do we have here? Oh, hey. Orange and blue yo-yos. All right. Let's put them in. Yep, they float. All right, wow. So magnifying glass that's really heavy sinks, and then the really light things that are full of air, the yo-yos, float. All right, let's see. Ooh, bright yellow golf balls. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh. All right, let's see if these golf balls sink or float. Oh, look, a yo-yo went to the bottom. So now the yo-yo sinks. <laughs> All right, back to the golf balls, ready? Whoa, yep, golf balls sink. All right, let's see. Ooh, some chips, snacks. All right, let's see if the bag sinks or floats, ready? Floats. But wait a second. What if we take the bag, open it up, and see if the chips inside sink or float? Ready? Whoa! <laughs> All of those float as well. Let's put the bag in there too. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, the dog bone, that's the color green. Do you think it'll sink or float? Pretty hard. It's very dense. Ready? Whoa! It just went to the bottom real quick. So it sinks. All right. Ooh, two more yo-yos. <laughs> yep, we already knew those those float and then eventually sink. Whoa! I bet you know it. This sinks and floats. Yeah. This is a weight. It's full of metal in there and it's really heavy. Ready? <laughs> yeah, that purple weight sinks. Ooh, look at the water. It's getting really murky because all of the, the chips are disintegrating and going in the water. All right, we better hurry before it gets too dirty to see if they sink or float. All right, these rubber toys <laughs> that are hollow. Ready? Yep, do you see? They went to the top. They float. <laughs> All right, a couple more. Some of this orange. Uh, nice soft dough clay stuff. <laughs> it sinks. <laughs> All right, here we go. Whoa, yep, it went to the bottom. It sinks. All right, and then colored pencils. Whoa, colored pencils float. Cause they're made out of wood. And a lot of the wood around the world sink, or floats I mean. Yeah, cause they're all on the top. All right, and last but not least, the neon glow sticks. Whoa. Whoa. Look at them, they're so bright. Whoa. All right, let's see if they sink or float. They sink. 
All right, that's all. Well, oh, I have a special surprise for you. The magical vial. This time, whoa, it has blue powder. See? Whoa! <laughs> all right, let's put the blue powder in here. Whoa! <laughs> All right, now we have to stir it. Whoa. It's making it really blue. <laughs> it's so fun to see what sinks and what floats. Wow. <laughs> this blue water is like the water you see in the Bahamas or Thailand. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Well, this is the end of this video. That was awesome doing this science experiment to see what sinks and what floats. If you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P I. Flippy. Good job. See you again. Bye bye. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Woo! Look at what it is! <laughs> this is a steam train, and today we are in Chehalis, Washington, and we are going to learn about trains! Now I'll show you all the parts of the exterior of the train. Like these down here. Whoa, look at the giant wheels. Whoa, there's so many of them. Wow. There's another one. Whoa. Oh, look at this one right here. Whoa, and look up here. Wow. That big thing up there? Yeah, that's the firebox. That's what heats up all the water and it creates steam, which is pressure. And then up there, that's the stack. And then the bell. And then the whistle. <laughs> Ooh. And back here, right there, that's the cab. That's where the operators of the train sit. <laughs> Ooh. And come back here. This is the tender. Ooh, and look over here. Those are the cars of the train. Now we're inside the cab of the train, and I'm with the engineer, and his name is Rick. Hey, Rick. Hi. Okay. And I'm over here with the fireman, and his name is Robert. Hey. Hello. <laughs> and they are going to explain some of the interior parts of the train. Hey, so what's this thing? This is called the Johnson bar. It makes the engine go forward, or if I go over here, it makes it go backward. Oh, can you I try? try that? You go ahead. All right. I dare you. Okay. Whoa, that's hard. Whoa. Okay. Okay, now I'll go back. Whoa. Going back's even harder. Ugh. Whoa. <laughs> cool. All right, so we decide which direction we're going. We control our speed with the throttle, like a gas pedal in a car. Ooh. So I pull that out, we'll go faster. Whoa. All right. And push it forward, and then you go slower. And like you okay. shut it clear off. Okay. The other thing I do is I've got a whistle up here to warn people that we're coming at a crossing. Try that. Oh, yeah. oh. Here we go. <laughs> wow, that's cool. And then the other thing I have to do is once in a while to stop the train. This stops the train here like that. And this one is for the engine only independent of the train. And what's this down here? 
that's a big fire in there. We're heating water to make steam. That gives us uh, the energy to go. Oh, wait, so fire, and, and that's the fireman over here. So what's this thing? This handle, I can make the fire get bigger or smaller. Ooh. Go like this. Whoa. See, is that a little more orange? <laughs> yep. That's a little less orange. Whoa, that's pretty cool. And so you sit here and do all the fire stuff, and oh, yeah. is there anything else that you do? Yeah, I gotta ring the bell to make sure people get out of the way if we're moving. See, I pull this rope, it rings. <laughs> cool, can I try? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, here we go. Whoa, whoa, that's cool. Well, thank you, gentlemen. Board. <laughs> now it's time for all the passengers to load on up so we can go for a ride. Okay, now it's my turn to ride the train. So come on, you can join with me. Whoa. Oh, look over here. Wow, this is the inside car where it's all enclosed. <laughs> that looks cool, but hey, let's go over there so then we can ride the train. In the outside. Come on. Oh, hello. Hey. Whoa, see, now we're outside. This is going to be so much fun. The wheels were a turning and the smoke was a puffin'. Off we go. Wow, it's so green over here in the field. Look. Woo, here come some trees. right there. Oh, so much green. I don't know what type of plants those are, but they kind of look like lily pads. Oh, wow. Okay, we were outside, but now we're inside an enclosed car. <laughs> what a beautiful ride. Gonna get 
get there fast Choo choo, here comes the train I could spend all day watching you go choo choo watching, singing, and dancing to the train song with you. Hey, if you like my show and you want to watch some more of my videos, all you gotta do is type in my name into the internet. You know my name. Yeah, it's Blippi. B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Good job. Now you know how to say and spell my name. Blippi! <laughs> Until next time, kids. Bye bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi! Hey! Look at what it is! Yeah! It's a lawnmower! <laughs> In this video, we are going to do some fun yard work together. Let's go! First, before getting on or operating a riding lawnmower, you must first wear ear protection. Yeah! And eye protection! Backward! Forward! Riding lawnmower.
at what we have here. This is a push lawnmower. But before we start this push lawnmower, we need to check two things. The first thing is gas. Let's check the gas. And the second thing is oil. We got to check the gas and the oil before we start this push lawnmower. All right, first things first, let's check the gas. And right here is where you check the gas. You unscrew this. Okay, then you look down inside. Yeah, we need gas. Okay, let's put the cap right there. And then let's take our gas can full of gas and be very careful. You might need to ask a parent to do this because this can be dangerous. Okay, there we go. The gas, yep, it's full now. Let's put the gas cap back on. <laughs> it's nice and tight. Okay, now we need to check the oil. Yeah, right here. Unscrew this one. Okay. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, the oil is really low. Okay, we need to open up the oil container and you need to, okay, there we go. Now let's pour some oil in right here. There we go. Check it again. Oh, yep, that's a perfect amount of oil. Okay, tighten this up, and now we're ready to go. Okay, we are ready to mow the lawn. should we do? Oh, I have an idea. A leaf blower. Yeah, this is going to blow away all the leaves. Watch this. got here this right here yeah those are weeds and I have the perfect yard tool for weeds it's called the weed eater yeah 
This spins around really quick and chops up all of the weeds. But first, apart from the ear protection, the eye protection, we also need hand protection for weed eating. So let's put on our gloves and then let's get to weed eating. watch more of my videos, you know what to do. Just search for my name, Blippi, B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi, good job, bye. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi, so much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout Blippi. Blippi.